What is social loafing, also known as the Ringelman effect? Simply put, this is the tendency of individuals to exert themselves less when they are part of a group undertaking an activity than they would individually undertaking that activity. That is, they try less when they're part of a group. And this tendency exacerbates or becomes worse the larger the group is. So a larger group, individuals are going to exert themselves even less than in a small group, and in a small group, even less than they would individually. Now, the reasoning behind this is individuals tend to believe that as part of a group, their individual effort contributes less. Thus, they are less motivated to exert themselves further. Now, this concept is highly related to other negative concepts in group performance, such as the free rider effect, and this is the tendency to allow other people to do your share of the work when you're a part of a group. And this, the sucker effect is the tendency of individuals to do less work because they perceive that there is a free rider in the group. So you can see how social loafing is closely related to these concepts. So this is social loafing.